Hello and welcome to my channel. This is a coloring book flip through review for the Dover coloring book Life in Ancient Mexico. Um, this is by John Green. Here is the front of the book. The size is eight and a half by 11 inches. And here comes my cat again. This is Willow. I'm sure she'll be in many of my videos. Here is the back of the book. Here is the spine. It is glue bound. And here is the thickness of the book. Glue bound books to me just seem really hard to open at the spine um, to get fully open, but that's just me. Um, inside you'll see the front and back covers both usually have an example or examples of how you can color a few of the pages that are in the book. There's an introduction page here and a map of where the ancient Mexico people were. Each page is going to have a little paragraph about what's going on in the picture. And I actually picked up several of these Dover coloring books, um, not the same ones, but um, different ones that I'll be reviewing at different museums that I've been at. A lot of museums now are carrying coloring books um, based on what you're seeing at that museum. Like I have a prehistoric mammal one that I did a review for a while back. And I also have an Indian Life Pre-Columbia, Pre-Columbian in North America book. Um, that I'll be doing a review on. Um, also have a Arctic and Ant Ar Antarctica life book that I'll be doing a review on as well that I've picked up at different zoos or um, museums that I've been at. There's an Indian artifact museum in Arkansas, in the Rogers area, I believe, um, Bentonville, Rogers area, that was the museum that I picked this particular book up at. It is, even if you're not interested in Indian stuff, um, that museum is top-notch. I was so impressed by it, and I'm not overly interested in Indian things, but I was trying to kill some time. I ended up spending like half the day there. It's just a tiny museum, but there was so much stuff to see there that um, it was just fascinating. Um, they have got a lot. So if, if you guys are ever in that area um, or live close to that area, vacation in the area or whatever, it is so worth your trip to stop there. And I think it's just called the, um, Indian Museum, Indian Artifact Museum, something like that. And I believe it's in Rogers, Arkansas. And I think having books like these on hand are really important, not only because they're very inexpensive compared to other coloring books that are out right now, um, but they give you a lot of choices as far as people um, practicing your skin tones, practicing your coloring techniques, 
um, different things like that without ruining a really cool picture in a more expensive book. I mean, you can buy three, four, five of these books for the cost of one of the other books that, that you can get out right now. That is the last page. So thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. Please subscribe down below. And thank you for watching. Happy coloring.